Right, we're following some breaking news right now in Montgomery County, Maryland. A judge just declared a mistrial in the 1971 killing of Special Sheriff's Deputy James Tappan Hall. Jurors in the case said they were hopelessly deadlocked after two days of deliberations. News Force Paul Wagner is at the courthouse in Rockville tonight and joins us live with the very latest. Paul, what happened? Well, Sean, yeah, this jury uh, deliberated uh, for more than two days. They started last Friday. They had off on Monday, and then for the last two days, they've been deliberating. But in the last few hours, they told the judge they were hopelessly deadlocked and they could not reach a verdict. I spoke with one juror who would not give his name, who told me that uh, several people on the jury didn't think that the state had proven its case and said that there was at least one, perhaps two, who were absolutely convinced that they would never convict this man, Larry David Smith, who's 71 years old. A few minutes ago, we heard from the special deputy's daughter, who's been here all week, uh, listening to the testimony in this case. Take a listen to what she had to say. And this is not over yet. We will be back. I don't understand how they did not come to a guilty verdict. I just don't know how they decided not to find this man guilty. May I say it's not the first time we've ever had a hung jury here in Montgomery County. Um, this is a case that, again, we are pledging to retry. We will, as we prepare for our retrial, which we are dedicated to pursue, we will pursue and, and try to develop any information that will make uh, the retrial of this matter as strong as possible on behalf of the Hall family. Larry David Smith was arrested in September of 2022 after cold case detectives reopened the case. At the time, Montgomery County Police said Smith had confessed. Smith was accused of shooting Special Deputy James T. Hall on the grounds of Manor Country Club in October of 1971. His confession, according to police, coming after two cold case detectives reopened the case and identified Smith as the prime suspect, a conclusion they came to after finding an audio interview Smith gave police in 1973. In that interview, investigators believed Smith told detectives details that had not been made public. With that information, the cold case detectives tracked Smith down at his home in New York where he agreed to an interview. In that interview, played for the juror, Smith admits shooting the special deputy, but the jury was not able to reach a verdict. And I asked uh, Carolyn Philo, the daughter of Special Deputy, about that. She was in the courtroom. She heard Larry Smith admit on tape that he had shot her father. She's absolutely dumbfounded that this jury could not come to a conclusion on any kind of guilt. That's the latest here from Rockville and Montgomery County Circuit Court. Back to you now. Paul Wagner with the latest for us. Paul, thank you.